Hi everyone, I'm Deronda and today I'm making this delicious, healthy black bean soup. And I'm starting off by using one pound of dried black beans. Now I have been soaking these for eight hours. You can soak them anywhere from eight to ten hours. And uh, for a pound of black beans, I've used about eight cups of cold water to soak them in overnight. And um, I'm going to get them cooking here in a little bit. And to this, I'm going to add eight cups of water, which are about two quarts of water. I have two cups of chopped onions right here that I'm going to add the last, maybe about the last hour of cooking. And I'm going to saute these onions with the green bell peppers and the two bay leaves. I have three cloves of chopped garlic right here. I have salt and pepper for flavoring. And over here I have a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar and this is cooking sherry. I have about a half of a cup of cooking sherry right here. I'm going to add these to a Dutch oven. If you don't have a Dutch oven, just use a very heavy saucepan. I'm going to add the fresh cold water and we're going to get these cooking and then we're going to turn them down to a simmer for two hours. Now add your black beans to your pan. And make sure you really rinse these beans several times before soaking them overnight. And now we're going to add the eight cups of water. And I've got my heat here on the stove on high and I'm going to bring this to a boil. And then when we bring it to a boil, we're going to turn it down to a simmer and put a lid on it and let it simmer for two hours. We've got our black beans boiling and now I'm turning them right down to a simmer so just turn it down to a simmer and if you'd like you can skim the top of your black beans it's really not necessary but just to um, get this frothy stuff off the top you can do that um, this is just proteins releasing from the black beans the beans have been cooking um, on simmer for almost an hour and I'm going to add a few tablespoons of olive oil into the skillet here and I'm going to start sauteing the onion and the garlic and the green bell peppers. Okay, and there goes the garlic and the green bell peppers along with the bay leaves. You're going to saute this until the onions start turning a little brown on the edges. This should take about five to eight minutes on medium heat. Alright, I've been sauteing my onions and peppers and garlic and see um, how brown the onions are turning on the edge. That's what you're that's what you're looking for before you add it to your black bean soup. Alright, let's add this into the soup now. Now we're going to add those onions and green peppers and garlics right into the soup here. Woo, everything smells so delicious. If you were here in my kitchen, mm, you would just be saying, I've got to have a bowl, I've got to have a bowl. I just can't wait to dig into it. And now would be the time to add the sherry which is a cooking wine, so just add the sherry right in there. And then we're going to add our apple cider vinegar. Now, we're going to add the salt and the pepper during the last 15 minutes of cooking. So, um, got the bay leaves in there. Now we're going to fish those out before we get ready to um, have a bowl of this black bean soup. All right. Now, put the lid back on your soup and let it simmer for another good one hour. And during this last hour of cooking, make sure your lid for your pot um, is overlapping just a little. That way some of the moisture can evaporate and we can have a thicker, heartier black bean soup. We're down to the last 15 minutes of cooking and whoo, there's our black bean soup. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add the salt and the pepper at this time. And you want to give it a quick little stir. And just um, let this um, simmer for about 15 more minutes and then 
come and taste it and see if, see if it needs any more seasonings. It may need a little bit more salt. Fifteen minutes are up. Now I'm going to give it a taste and let's see if it needs some more seasoning. It definitely needs a little bit more salt, so I'm going to go over here and add about a half a teaspoon of more salt. And that should do it. All right, let's give that a nice little stir. And now it's time to put the lid on this. I'm going to add the lid to it. And we're going to let this sit off the heat for one hour. And then we're going to bring it back over on the heat. I'm going to heat this up again on medium heat. And I'm going to fish out those bay leaves. There's one. And there's another one in there somewhere. Ooh. Well, there it is. It's like fishing. Fishing out those bay leaves. See? Got it. And then I'm taking the side of um, my um, wooden spoon here. And I'm going to mash. Um, actually, that's getting a little warm. I'm just going to mash some of these beans up against the side of the pan. Okay, just mash as many as you'd like. That way it'll make it a really thick and hearty soup. And boy, does it smell so delicious. I'm telling you, it's going to be very, very good. Uh, if you would like to take two or three cups of this and puree it in a food processor, that would be great. If you have one of those boat motors that you could stick down in here and puree it a little, that would be great. Um, but I'd rather not dirty up any dishes, so I'm just using the back of this wooden spoon. And it works just as good. And I am getting hungry. Can't wait for a bowl of this. All right, give it about 10-15 minutes to heat up. This soup's on. Black bean soup smells delicious. I have topped it with a little sour cream and some parsley and salsa. Let's give this a try. Mmm. The best. I'm telling you. It's the best black bean soup. Mmm. Kind of dig right in. Mmm, mmm, mmm. The black beans are cooked perfectly tender with the acidic from the apple vinegar and the cherry cooking wine and the onions and the peppers. It just brings us together very beautifully. Hmm. I hope you all give this a try. Give me thumbs up, like, leave me a comment, and subscribe to be the first to get my new videos. Until then, thanks a million for watching, and this is Deronda with Foods 101.